A couple of LVC semifinal contests taking place last night, including boys soccer, where unbeaten top seed Parkland took on fourth seed Northampton. That took place at Whitehall High School. In a 2-3 matchup, it was second seed Emmaus and third seed Freedom going head-to-head. -head. That game taking place at Jay Bernie Crumb Stadium in Allentown. Mike Briscoe has highlights of both contests. Tuesday night, the second meeting of the season between Parkland and Northampton, the first coming just one week ago on October 9th. On that day, it was the Trojans coming out on top, a 2 to nothing winner, but both teams come in with a clean slate with a trip to the LVC championship on the line. 11 minutes in, Parkland controlling the action, and Nolan Hay will give it a rip off the deflection. Maybe a bit ambitious, but a heck of an effort nonetheless, as it doesn't miss by much. Still a scoreless game with under five to play before halftime. The Trojans on the attack again as Darren Aaron De Silva sends a nice ball ahead for Bilal Muhammad. He throws on the brakes and gets a good look, but what a save by Northampton freshman keeper Austin Cooper to preserve the 0-0 tie headed to the half. However, just a minute and 44 seconds into half number two, that changes when Dylan Angle plays a perfect through ball for Muhammad, and this time the junior forward beats Cooper with the left foot. Parkland takes a 1-0 lead in the 42nd minute of action. Same score, 54th minute now, and the top-seeded Trojans add to their lead as Cooper comes out of goal but is unable to haul it in. Nick Hutchinson is there and finishes from a difficult angle. The K-Kids would put one in late, but Parkland hangs on for the 2-1 to win, advancing to Thursday's LVC championship game. You know, I think our biggest focus is to be uh, mentally tough. We're always going to have some advice, adversity in the game, and we just are trying to ask the kids to, to worry about what they can control in their own game and not worry about anything else. And I think they've bought into that, and hopefully we'll do that come Thursday.